Hey everybody, it is injection time. I've got a lot to do tonight. It's about 9.30 p.m. Here we go. Okay, I'm gonna get ready to do the Menopure. So you have the little powder vial and then you have the um, sodium chloride, okay? So pop the little cap off. Pop, pop off. And pop this one off. Then we're gonna take our alcohol swab and we're gonna swab the top one. So here's the top. Swipe, swipe. Oh, swipe, 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 swipe. Big, big syringe, which don't get freaked out, but uh, it's a huge needle, but this is not what you're going to be injecting yourself with. So that's good news. Okay. Um, what am I doing? Okay, I'm gonna <laughs> pull this. I'm gonna take the top off. I'm gonna stick the needle in. I'm gonna pull out one mil, milliliter of the liquid. And then I'm going to stick this needle in the center of the powder. And I'm, it's gonna dissolve and I'm gonna swirl, swirl, swirl. And then pull up all the liquid. So it should be still one milliliter. And then I'll switch out the needle <laughs> and inject. Did I repeat myself? It's because I'm making sure that I know what I'm doing. Okay, so there's the needle. See how big it is? It's pretty big. Okay, here's my sodium chloride. Let's see how much I can show you here. So we're gonna go, oh wait, trick, trick, I forgot. You gotta pull some air into that syringe so that's one milliliter right there because then it makes it way easier to pull out the liquid okay so push it right oh my gosh into the center that was like really retarded okay now you see this you're going to push the air into the vial and then move the needle down into the liquid so that when that syringe one it really wants to pull out it gets all the liquid so go beyond one milliliter and then you're gonna push it back up until that little wet guy is right at the one you see that okay then you can like flick it a couple times see if the bubbles go up but there's one little bubble on the bottom and that's okay Okay, so we've got one mil of the sodium chloride. So, oh, we're gonna have to take that out. Okay, here's the powder. You see it? So it's kind of cool. Right when the liquid hits the powder, um, it'll dissolve really fast. So let's see if you can see that. So here I go. In there. Okay, ready? Watch it. Pew. Okay, so we went in there. Now we're gonna leave the needle in. And we're just gonna gently swirl around. So see, it's still, it's really, really clear, like water. That's what you want, okay? All right, so now we are going to invert this guy again. And we have to pull out all of the liquid. So this, this gets kind of tough. I see it, but you want to get the needle as far down as possible so that when you're pulling out the liquid, you get all of it, all of it. It can, it can be tricky. I think I've gotten pretty good at it, honestly. So pull that syringe way down so you make sure there isn't any extra liquid coming out. Kind of move this, angle it, make sure you got everything. Okay, so I did go back. We gotta put the cap back on this crazy needle. Almost lost it. Okay. Now then we're gonna cap it. And oh, what am I doing? Hello. Oh my lord, there we go. Needle off, put it in the sharps container. And then we get our 
injection needle, just teeny tiny, so it's okay. It's easier to inject with this guy. Okay, are we still good here? Yeah. Okay, twist that guy on. Okay, now, okay, now I need to alcohol swab my body. So yesterday I did everything on the right side, so now I'm going to do the left side. And you want to be like within, um, well, around the belly button, but at least an inch away from the belly button is what I have heard and read. Okay, so for this one, um, we'll just do like right here, so clean that up. Okay, and then you want to let it dry. That's really, really important to let it dry because it'll sting really bad if you put the injection in there when it's not dry. So we want to get it dry. Now, I put that needle on. You're gonna take the cap off and can you see the needle? It's teeny tiny, it's tiny. It is, I know it kind of looks big, but it's really small. So what you're gonna do is push up that syringe and you can see the liquid going up it. Ooh, and then there was one little drip drop. That's right where you want it because then you know that the liquid is right there. Okay. So now we're going to hope that that's dry. Okay. I did it like right here. So we're going to grab it and this is, this is the hard part. Let me see where I can get this a little bit better for view. Okay. One, two, and see, I hesitate. It's stupid, but I do. Okay, here we go. Oh, easy, easy, easy. You always think it's going to hurt and it totally doesn't. So as you can see, I pushed it in there and then I let go. My stomach's really relaxed is usually not what you do when you're on camera. You usually suck it all in. And so I'm really slowly pushing that medication in. Once you get all of the medicine pushed in, you just hold it there. Count to four. One, two, three, four. And pull the needle out. Easy peasy. Okay, recap that needle. Cap it, twist it, put it in your sharps container, and then I just throw this guy away. Okay, so next we will do the gondolette.